How's it going, guys? We are back in another video here, and this is Making Profit, episode number two, if you want to call it an episode. So, uh, this one is not really making profit, it's just a good way to make coins, really. So, what I suggest is, the only thing is, there's two methods, there's two hut challenges that are going to work for this, okay? So, what you can do is you go to hut challenges, alright? The ones you want to keep an eye out for are... The Fridays, the flashback ones, okay? So the flashback challenge, what you what you do is you do the three challenges, okay, flashback game one, win the game, score a power play goal, score a shorthanded goal, all right, 500, 550, 650, nice amount of coins right there, okay? Then challenge number two, of course, you win the game, take eight more shots on your opponent, score three goals, the rewards are 550 coins, 650 coins, and a challenge collectible. Challenge collectible you really don't need to worry about, but here's where it gets really good. Flashback game number three, win the game, take 25 shots on goal, maximum two penalty minutes, 600 coins, 700 coins, and the all-important flashback collectible, which sells for 20k. So, that's an easy 20k, is what I'm saying to you guys. Or, or... Or you could keep the flashback collectible, and every week this comes out, you could just keep accumulating collectibles, and you'll just get four, and then you could eventually do a flashback set for yourself and just get one of the cards if you really want. Of course, it would take four weeks, but at the end of the day, it's pretty good. So you figure this, it's 20k a week. It, it really is. So you, you do this challenge, 20k, then next week, 20k, another week, 20k. I mean, it's looking like you can make almost close to 100k a month just from this. So, I mean, it's... I, I think it's a pretty solid uh, method for sure. So, the other one is the Team of the Week challenges. Very similar to this. Um, it's just you're earning a Team of the Week collectible. Uh, so, it's a very similar thing like that. So, of course, that comes out on Wednesdays. So, keep an eye out for that. As I'm making this video, there's only four hours to go on the flashback challenges. So... You know, get to it. I mean, by the time I upload this, it probably will be like, uh, I don't know, an hour. So, I mean, just, or an hour or two. So, get to it, guys. It's a huge opportunity. It shouldn't take you long. I mean, as long as your team's solid, uh, I think you'll be all right. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, any other challenges that I really need to tell you guys about? I mean, uh, Halloween challenges are decent, but... I don't, I don't believe Halloween collectibles go for much, but if you want to get two Halloween collectibles, this is a set to do it at. But I definitely say the Team of the Week collectibles and the Flashback collectibles are the most valuable ones to go after, so I would definitely do that as well for you guys. Uh, as you're noticing probably, there's just a lot of this making profit it has to do with the Flashback set. So I'm going to also show you another thing about the Flashbacks, okay? So you can go to the sets. Uh, here is the flashback set. Um, I still haven't done this yet. I, I'm gonna do the flashback player. I still haven't done the curry yet. But what I will say is, guys, I'm looking at some of the cards here. They are very, very, very good. Uh, one, this one I'm looking at really, really good. I mean, I saw synergies S2 and TN2. Very good. And his shot is like 95. Hands are 96. This card is very good. So I'm thinking if I get the 15 master collectibles. I will be getting this card. I mean, a little bit of time to get, but you know what? It's looking like a really good card. Hey, I mean, why not? While we're at it, I might as well just do this set right now, okay? So we're going to search the collectibles. I should have four, maybe even five, honestly. Let's see what we got here. We're going to have four. Okay, that's good enough. That's all I need, right? So there you go. Going to get the flashback. Yari Curry. Complete the set. And again, I mean, I'm not going to use this curry probably because... Uh, I just, I, I have a, the Legend Curry on my team, I use him at center, and I don't want to really lose the center, because he's a good face-off, so there you go, there's a Master Collectible, and there is a Flashback Yari Curry, let's look at the stats quickly, as you guys can see, the face-offs are completely nerfed at 70, I believe the stats are actually better on this Yari Curry than uh, the Legend Curry, except for the face-offs, so that's, that's pretty damn nice, alright, so, hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, Leave a like, alright? So, I mean, let me know if you want to see more of these in the future. Hopefully this is helping you guys out. Because I want to keep uploading these videos, alright? So, I will see you guys in the next video.